Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be showing you how you can clear cache data from your PC, whether it is Windows 7, 8 or 10 and make your PC faster, plus free up some space as well. Also, the steps that I'll be showing you in the video won't remove or change any data in your PC. And these steps are completely safe to go home. By the way, 97% of the viewers do watch my videos but forget to subscribe. So make sure to subscribe the channel right now if you haven't. Okay, so first up go to the search bar and type percent ten percent. Open the percent ten percent folder and select everything in here and press shift delete to permanently delete all these. And leave those files which can't be deleted. Go to the search bar again and type run. In the run window, type temp and delete all the files in here as well. Open run again. This time type prefetch. The prefetch folder will open and select everything or you can just press ctrl a and stop selecting each and every file like this and then shift delete now go to this pc and open up local disk c here you will find a windows.old folder but not everyone will have the windows.old folder only if you have reset your PC or you have upgraded to windows 10 from windows 7, 8 or 8.1 then you might be having this windows.old folder and if you do have this folder go ahead and delete this and don't worry about losing any sort of data because everything in the windows.old folder is not used at all by the current version of windows that you're using so it's completely safe to remove this folder because it is just eating up a lot of space now go to the windows folder and scroll down until you find software distribution open up this folder and then download and remove everything present in there Now just right click your C drive and go to properties, under tools section click on optimize. First of all hit analyze and then optimize and this will defrag your drives. Under schedule optimizations click change settings and you can select weekly, monthly or daily depends on you. Yeah, it says needs optimization so now click optimize and wait for it to complete. It can take quite a lot of time, literally 15 to 20 minutes or even more. But I don't recommend waiting for that long. So make sure to defrag all your drives. You can just go ahead and close it after a few passes, no need to wait for it to complete. 
the general tab go to this cleanup wait for some time and make sure to check every box in order to remove all the clutter Now open up your web browser, then go to settings, scroll down until you find clear browsing data. In the time range drop down make sure to select all time and check all these boxes. But obviously if you check password and autofill boxes, this is going to remove all your data from the websites that you have saved your information in. Do the same with every single web browser you use. Okay, so now this step is completely optional because I'll be using a third party app to clear up some more space and remove any cache data if present. Although we have removed quite a lot of cache data and files manually, but still if there is something left, this third party app that is CCleaner might help you get rid of. Tell me you're no good I'm brushing the weight of you The weight of you Of my shoulder uh, so Don't wear my cigarette And when all the smoke is clean I'm brushing the weight of you The weight of you The weight of you I need a no man Start, open up C Cleaner and on the left hand side go to the custom clean option. In the custom clean you can analyze and it will take some time. Okay, so we can clear up to 459 MB. Now just hit run cleaner. Now just wait until it's complete.
So there's a summary of the cleanup. You can have a look if you want and just close the C cleanup. So this was it for the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Drop a like and share with your friends. And thanks for watching. See you soon in the next video.